Hey everybody. So I took some time off this week uh, to rest and relax. I'm just hanging out at the house and I'm working on the go-kart, trying to get the brakes and the steering taken care of, which not easy. So let me show you what I did. It's pretty cool. Check this out. Okay, Here, here's the old brake mechanism. It's just, it was floppy in this thing, sat on the disc. Here's the pads. And it just, I could never get it to really stop. I don't think it was made for big back tires like this. Well, big-ish. So, um, this type of uh, go-kart is no longer made. It's called a Gurf Dog. And um, they didn't come with uh, hydraulic brakes, or at least this model didn't. So, I had to make my own. Here's what I did. <laughs> There's my shitty welding, but whatever. I'd like to see you bitches do better. So, okay. All right. So I got this plate and I made the this little spacer in there. Here's here's where the uh, the pads hit the rotor, and it gets even better because I had to make my own jig for the master cylinder. This part is pretty cool. So, so this guy works by when you're pushing in this way, it makes the brakes go. But I didn't have any room up here to put it. It just, there's between the brake pedal, it just wasn't gonna work. So I reverse, I reversed it. Check this out, it's pretty cool. Okay. So, got some metal shavings. Let me back this up a little bit. So here is the rod that's connected to the brake and when the when the brakes get pushed it's got a like a fulcrum on it watch that see how it's pushing it in and here's a reservoir see that so i've got a return spring on it right there and it's um so if I, if I ever need to adjust it, that's what these extra holes are for. If I need to, I don't know, do something different. I have no idea. If the brakes wear down or something like that, maybe I can mess with these. That's why I made this bar angled so that I can make this thing adjustable. And it is pretty damn cool. So I'm probably gonna regret making this the, the hydraulic hose go on the outside of the buggy because you know if it ever gets hung up on something it's just going to rip the whole thing apart <laughs> but this is just going to be buzzing oh here's the reservoir uh this is just going to be buzzing around the neighborhood so it's pretty cool so that's what i did you want to see what's next? Steering. Right now, the steering, it works, but it's got this Pittman arm. This thing in it. Oh, sorry for the shake. Can you see how that works? And it sucks. It just, it's hard to steer. I got the, I got this thing so the kids could drive it, kind of. And uh, it's just not, it's not working. Um, they're not gonna be strong enough for a while to drive this thing. So 
I'm gonna make it better. So I am putting a rack and pinion box on. So that's gonna be next. I'm gonna cut all that shit out of there and try to make this thing run right. It's gonna be crazy. So that's it. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good day.